On this channel, I share sewing tutorials and pattern drafting videos and in today's video, I am going to be doing something different. I decided to show you guys how to go about tying different hair gears. As I am very busy this period, I really do not have the time to sit and film a food tutorial for you guys. I feel like this is something that one or two people might actually find um, helpful. So if this is something you're interested in, you know what to do, keep on watching and let us get started. To tie any of these hairstyles, you will need something strong to give you that box shape that you usually see in front now this is something you can make with um with wadding or padded or probably putting a, um, multiple fabrics together to just have something um, rectangular in front or you can be like me and use a carton <laughs> so this is a very small carton i have here and of course you will need the fabric that you're going to be making use of so, so what you're going to do is for the very first hairstyle we are going to do the simplest one which is for you to place your get try to get the middle of the fabric and you're going to place the cotton from the middle like this place it something like this and you're going to start folding it in so basically you're just wrapping it with your fabric so like this it's really very simple so wrap it multiple times you can wrap it about four to five five times it totally depends on how much um fabric you have for your hair tie that you're working with so once you're through with this you can see what it looks like now what i do is i flip it over like this and then i'm going to put it very close to my eye eyebrow can you see what i'm doing and then i'm going to Put it to the back like this make sure it's very tight and then i'm going to go ahead and tie it up um before you do this you want to make sure that if you have like hair i have a very long hair as you can see so i had to tie it up very nicely at the back i forgot to like show you guys this so tie it up very nicely to the back so that the hair is not like um coming in the way although you can actually free your hair as well and still tie the hair tie so yeah so make sure it's very tight and then you have this tucking all the excess fabric that you might have at the top make sure everything is looking it at the top and at this area here you can see what i have it's looking really nice so once you're through with this you're going to now try to tuck this particular one in you can decide to create like a style at the back with it so maybe something like folding it in a little bit like this you can see i've tucked that particular one in and then you take this as well and just like try to tuck it in somewhere make sure you do it tightly so that it looks neat at the back okay so yeah i'm sure with that and this is Okay, so this is what this one looks like this is the easiest of them this is the one i do most of the time so let me show you guys how to go about two other simple styles okay let's go for style number two now for style number two you're going to come close to the edge of your fabric here and instead of doing it at the center you're going to be doing this one on the edge so we are going to place this in like this make sure you have some space here but it should not be at the center so i'm going to fold it in like this so basically after folding you're just going to tie it around your head just like you did on the first one we had it's just that this one is longer on one side than you would be having on the other side so i'm just going to go ahead and just tie it up and make sure that i tuck in all the rough sides so now to create the second style you're going to now bring out this one 
long one that you have here and start twisting it just like you see me doing like this so as you're twisting it you're going to place it around the first one that you had so you can see me so twist it just centralize it on the carton that you had there that square thing just centralize it and then try to tuck in the excess that you have at the back So now this is it for the second style and it's really very simple and very nice as well this is what it's looking like on the sides and this is what the back of it is looking like you can see it's actually looking very neat at the back now we're going to be using this same wrap to create the last one so basically what i'm going to do is to open up the fold that i did so i'm just going to take it back to where it started from just unfold it and then i'm just going to take it as it is like this and i'm just going to use it to cover up the square cotton that we had earlier and yeah i think this is the one they call zara buhari style i think this is the particular one they call um, zara buhari style it's actually very nice and it's actually a very simple one as well Okay guys we've come to the end of this video thank you so so much for watching if you find it interesting do want to give it a thumbs up like share and subscribe and i will see you guys in my next video bye